Welcome back to Just Nigeria from the BBC and Channels TV. I'm Ajoke Hulotsi. Thanks for staying with us. Still to come. We check out the multipreneur empowering women and young people in the agro value chain. But before that, let's meet a young Nigerian woman using art to address social ills. Through Shako painting, Tosin Akinba is giving a voice to women who have been victims of domestic abuse, rape, and other issues. Our paintings aren't only visually appealing, they express the pain and torture that women sometimes endure. Have a look. As a child, I grew up thinking men view women as sexual objects. My name is Natosin Akingba. I am a self-taught charcoal artist. All around me, the things I was hearing, the things I see, I saw women being played with, you know, like toys. My charcoal art is giving a voice to young women out there who have been sexually, physically and emotionally abused. We normally see charcoal as something ordinary, but I see charcoal as something extraordinary. I'm a black woman. Charcoal is black. I can use that medium to express myself, to create something extraordinary, something that when people see it, they will be in awe. I quit my job to focus on charcoal art um, because at that time, I was faced with a lot of verbal abuse from male customers that come to the firm to inquire about you know, what we do and how we can be of um, service to them. I do not do what I do for the money. I do it for the love of art, to express myself and also to show people out there that there are women like myself that deserve to be heard, that deserve to be listened to, that deserve to be paid attention in society. My favorite piece is um, Light and Darkness. It reflects on religious abuse by pastors and religious leaders and also domestic violence. My most memorable experience is a phone call I got from a lady. She told me that one of my art pieces um, really inspired her to come out of the situation that she was in at that time. At that time she was being um, sexually abused and she was being um, physically abused. My greatest influence is the everyday Nigerian woman. Their experiences, their struggles, their success, their challenges. Because I see myself in these women, young, old, I see myself in them. I see myself in their struggles, I see myself in their fears, I see myself in their happiness. I don't think Nigeria really appreciates charcoal art as they should. Because personally, when I meet people and then they see what I do, they tell me, oh, okay, um, it looks good. They don't take the time to appreciate the time. They just see it as something of a decoration. I represent every black woman and I believe we shouldn't place judgments on women that have been abused. Beautiful paintings, well done, Tosin.